Good evening, students. Good evening. Welcome. Hello. How are you today? Mm, everything is okay. As always. <laughs> As always. Okay. Very nice. Good. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, good evening. How are you today? I'm fine. Very, very fine. Awesome. But, uh, I I was going to listen to for the free pass, free public class. I'm driving and because I took to move uh, the different tools in my work and I tried to, to do it in, in this time for the traffic, but the traffic is very, very, very hard. And I tried to, to be uh, as soon possible with you. No? Uh, okay, very nice. Let me know when you're ready, okay? Okay, okay, thank you, teacher. Okay, welcome. Okay, we're going to start in a few minutes. We're going to give you a chance for the rest of the classmates in order to get connected, okay? Hey, teacher. Yeah, <clears throat> we're going to give you just a, a time in order to get connected for the rest of the class, in order to be ready for uh, this uh, one of the last classes that we're going to have, okay? Good evening, teacher. Good evening, good evening, welcome.
Okay, students, good evening, good evening, welcome. Good evening. How are you today? Very good, teacher. Kind of busy, but that's good. Okay, awesome. Ready for the class? Yes, ready. Okay, that's Hello, nice. That's, uh, good evening, how are you? Good evening. Fine, teacher. Everything okay. okay? Okay, that's perfect, that's perfect, that's good. What about the rest? Good evening, how are you? Carlos, good evening, how are you today? Adela, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you today, Adela? <laughs> better it than was... yesterday? Better than yesterday? <laughs> It was better than yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> I remember yesterday. I want to sleep. <laughs> okay, that's good. Perfect. Okay, what about you, Yvette? Good evening. Welcome. Okay. Mariano, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Very nice. Very nice, teacher. Everything how was your okay? day? How was your day? Fine. I'm so tired, but everything okay. Awesome. That's perfect. That's perfect. Very nice. Roberto, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Okay. How are you today? Uh, it, it was fine, teacher. Okay, awesome. Very good. Very good. Okay, Rosemary, good evening. Welcome. Hi, teacher. Good night. How are you today? Um, in my case, pretty bad because I have problems to connect to the classes because I have my mom in the hospital because he's really sick. He ha She has um, cirrhosis chronica. Uh, and okay. they really bad. It, actually, today, I don't know if tonight or tomorrow, she stay in surgery. Oh, okay, very nice. So you have been in the hospital these days before? Yes, because she's in the east mm -hmm. and it's too complicated, all the, the things. The yeah, hospital. I know. Oh, no. Okay, I hope uh, your mom gets better, okay? Thank you, teacher. Okay, you're welcome. Okay, what about you, Debbie? Good evening. Welcome. Good evening, teacher. <clears throat> How are you today? Uh, my day was good but tired. Okay, good but tired. Okay, <laughs> it, it's almost the end of the week, right? It's casi el, el fin de la de la semana laboral, right? That's why the energies are lower than the beginning. Yes. Okay, Actually, right. this week, um, ¿cómo sería? ¿Ha sido? Has been? Ha, has been, very nice. Has Good, been, Has been hot. Hot? Because hard. Ah, oh, hard. Is, okay, okay, yes. very nice. Uh-huh. A lot of work to do. Yes, we have a, a order, big order to mm -hmm. 17,000 to llaveros, como se dice, keys. Key rings, key rings. Key, key rings, so. Uh, so. <laughs> okay, has been like complicated, right? Yes. 2,000, you told me 2,000. 7,000. 7,000. Key rings. Yes. Yes. Oh my God. Oh, that's <laughs> too much. Only we for for finish only need two thousand more and finish. But so you already you already have five thousand. Yes. Okay, but at least there are too much. <laughs> okay, yes. well, too many key rings, right? Yes. <laughs> okay, very nice, good, awesome. Okay, 
Um, we're going to uh, take the attendance list. As soon as you listen, your name, please tell me present, okay? Adela Trinidad González Consuera. Present. Very nice. Aminda René Figueroa de Manzano. Belén Batre García. Present, teacher. Very nice. Carlos William Membreño Núñez. Present, teacher. Very nice. Debbie Yasmin Giron Ramírez. Present, teacher. Okay. Very nice. Domingo Alexander González. Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Present, teacher. Okay. Very nice. Jose Roberto Martinez Bernabe. Leticia Guadalupe García de Miranda. Mariano José Paca Santa María. Okay, very nice, Leticia. Okay, very nice, Mariano. Oscar Anulfo Villatoro Herrera. Present. Okay. Rosemary Ventura de Arguello. Present, teacher. Okay, very nice. Rosibel del Carmen López. Salvador Augusto Sorto Rivas. Present, mister. Very nice. Sony Ivette Alvarenga. Present. Okay. Vanessa Noemí Reyes Lemos. Present, teacher. Okay, very nice. Walter Mar Castaneda Perlera. Okay. Wendy Karina Morales Amaya. Okay, some students that have not uh, get connected at the moment of I call your name. All right. Okay, awesome. Okay, we're going to um, start with unit four, which is the last one that we're going to, to work for. And it is about the ones that we need to work with, right? With this unit. Okay, I don't know. Can you watch the screen? Yes, teacher. Okay, very nice, good. Yes. Okay, so we have unit four is talk about, it talks about, sorry, um, inventory, right? It's going to be about inventory. So that's the, the topic of unit four and that's what we're going to be working for, right? Okay. So for example, we have here an objective. I would like to listen to uh, some of you in order to talk about this part because yesterday we started to work with this one, right? About some hazardous materials. We work about some um, important aspects that we need to know and we classify in general housekeeping, falls and other preventable mishaps, right? And all the stuff. Okay, so today we're going to work with unit four and the topic is inventory. Okay, uh, let me listen to, uh, let me listen to Belen. Can you please read this objective? Yes, teacher. I'll, unit four, I will able to. Okay. I will, okay, I will be able to, yes. Okay, I will be able to explain the relevance of an effective inventories management. Okay, so I will be able to explain the relevance of an effective inventory management. So that's what we're going to be like ready for in order with this unit, we're going to talk about um, the relevance or in this case, to talk about how important is an effective inventory management. So we're going to work with it, right? Okay, very nice. So then we have here, Two common questions. This is the first one, right? Until here. Okay. Uh, let me listen to Adela. Can you please read the first question? Does your company handle it with expiration, expiration, <laughs> expiration, expiration, date, expiration dates? Expiration dates. Okay, does your company handle items with expiration dates? Okay, repeat, does your company handle 
with items with expiration dates? Does your company handle item with expiration dates? Items, items. Items. Okay, very nice, good. Okay, so that's a good question in order to talk about, about some uh, important aspect of inventory, right? Then we have the next one. Uh, let me listen to Carlos. Can you please help me to read the next one? Okay. What happens to products that go out of, out of season or become irrelevant in the market? Okay, very good. We have two important questions to debate or to talk for, right? So uh, the first one that is that does your company handle items with expiration dates? That's the first part, right? And the next part is what happened to products that go out of season or become irrelevant in the market? So that's the ones that we're going to talk about, right? Okay. Uh, we're going to make a practice, but later on, because right now we're going to have this part, which says Sara is asking Ramon some tips on the basics of inventory control. Read the conversation and take turns practicing with a partner. So right now we're going to have this part. I would like to listen to, uh, let me check. Vanessa is going to be Sara. And let me listen. Uh, Mariana is going to be Ramon. Okay. Okay. How does inventory management work, Ramon? Ramon? You need to have an out product in your inventory to send to your customers when they want it, but you don't want to have too much in your inventory, or you will be paying a lot of money to having started. Oh, well, I was thinking of investing in some new cases for the L for X. Don't do it. Now then, the, know that the L for X is on store. You will not sell much. That's one of the problems with inventory management. When you have too much inventory because you are now you're down, you call sell more than you did. And there is change in the market. You mean you mind and up paying for product you can sell. Very nice, very good. Thank you. Okay, let me listen right now to um Roberto is going to be Ramon and Dev is going to be Sara, okay? S sorry, teacher, I can read because I I I still driving. Ah, you're still driving. Yeah, sorry. Okay, Carlos, can you help me in this part? Okay, Carlos is going to be Ramon and Sara is going to be Debbie, okay? Okay. Okay. How, how does inventory management work, Ramon? You need to have enough products in your inventory to sell to your customer when they want. They want it. But you don't want to have too much in your inventory, or you will be paying a lot of money to have to have it stored. Oh well, I was thinking of invent investing in some new cases for the Elf Phone X. Don't do it. Now that the Elf Phone X is on a stores, you will not sell much. That's one of the problems with the inventory management. When you have too much inventory because you say you will sell more than you did. And I can see. Uh, and there is a change in the market. You might end up paying for products you can sell. Okay, very nice. Good. We're going to check some, some words that we need to take care of pronunciation, okay? Okay. Um, Investing. Repeat investing. 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 Okay, very nice. Uh the next one is thought. Thought. So no es thought direct, it's not common thought thought. Thought. I thought. Yes, I thought. Thought. Okay. Is el, el, el pasado del verbo? Think. 
think. Very nice, good. I thought, but because you thought, dice, porque tú pensaste, ¿verdad? Okay, very nice, good. Okay, then tenemos la siguiente. Um, uh, end up. End up. End up. Is a phrase of that? End up, yes. Phrase of that. End up. End up. End up. Okay. Uh, this conversation is talking about uh, the importance of um, the inventory management, right? Okay. So right now you're going to do just one activity. I need you to go to uh, worry pairs, but you're going to talk about this one first. You have to talk about these two questions. What do you think about, right? Okay, about the first question, does your company handle items with expiration dates? That's the first question you're gonna make to your classmate between you, okay? And then the next one. After that, you're going to take turns to practice the conversation and you're going to find here the answer for this, okay? That's the first part of the activity that we're going to work for. Is it clear? Students? Yes, teacher. Yes. Oh, okay. very nice, good. I'm gonna check right now in order to put the groups in order. Okay. Mm. Rosabella, are you active? Yes, teacher. Okay. Rosemary, you told me you're going to be a listener today, right? Yes, teacher, but I can stay in this activity right now if you want it. Uh, uh, okay, awesome. Very good. Okay, very nice. Good. Thank you. Okay. Mariano, you are you are able to participate, right? Teacher, I'm driving. Oh, you're driving. Yes. Okay, very nice. Let me let me make some moments here. Okay, very nice. There we go. Hello, Debbie. Hello, Manes. Hello, how are you? Good, and you? Good. How are you? Okay. Um, okay. 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 You have to, to answer the question. The question, right? 
Let me open the manual. Page 33, ¿verdad? Yeah. Yes, yes. Only the question? This is the first part. Then we have to read again the text and answer, answer the question. Ah, okay. okay. First, and let's start. Does your company handle items with expiration dates? Does your company handle items with expiration dates? Mm -hmm. Is is for uh, is question personal question? How? <laughs> o inventadas? ¿Cómo así? In, in, in your in your word? In, in, in my case, yes. Mm -hmm. The ink last thing. Always have perfect hey, Teacher, how do you say ten year? I'm sorry, I'm sorry. How do you say ten year? Nosotros uh -huh. lo encontramos como to die, pero no sé cómo pronunciarlo y no sé si es correcto. Uh, yeah, uh, puede ser die. Creo que también está otra que se llama. No me acuerdo si es tint. Ajá, es que, es que, no se sabe, Google Translate is not always a, a good uh, translator, so, and have died, D-Y-E, and tint, I don't know what is the correct one. Um, los dos son sinónimos, both are synonyms. Okay. Ajá, uh -huh. but uh, how is the context about? Telas. Ah, to tend the. Uh, uh, okay, very nice. Good. Okay, so continue, Carlos. You were you was talking. Okay. The next question is: What happens to products that go out of season or become irrelevant in the market? Sorry, sorry. Right now, I'm trying to search in the manual. Do you can you show the the question because I don't have it right now opening my computer? Yeah, sure. I can I can share my for pharmaceutical product. Ah, oh, pharmaceutical, but it's the pharmaceutical and the all products. Is is are you, are relevant in the market? Uh, if doesn't sell, uh, the products uh, will be discount discount discontinued. Mm -hmm. uh, don't product anymore. <laughs> okay. Doesn't does the product? And the, with the with the expiration date. Uh, the product is destroyed. Mm -hmm. It's a it's a, mm, a a process. It's it's mm -hmm. a little bit complicated yeah, because the story uh, is for other a uh, company. Mm. Author is say author is say for the Ministerio de Salud. Oh yeah, it's a uh, mandatory. Yes, uh, mandatory. Yeah. Other other author is say author is company. Mm. Yeah. No lo podemos Pero, decir nosotros. Mm. I I know in my company. Uh, uh, yes, uh, has a handle items with the expiration dates. It's a re regulatory legal uh, 
in the Ministerio de... You were at, at McCormick, right? Yes, yes. Ah, okay. Yeah. Uh -huh, it's Sorry. Uh, all the products, uh -huh, it is with expiration dates. And what happened is some product that go out session or become irrelevant in the market, but uh, in this case, uh, I think remove the the the, the market and reinvent another. This is I think is the 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 process. A <laughs> whole how uh, do you destroy them? Your company destroy them. Yeah. All the problems. company. Yeah. yeah. Is uh, la ene desperdicio and also a. Uh, I'm not sure if the. In some case a. Uh, uh, if, um, give to the to all employees the the products uh, before the expiration date, or destroy destroy it destroy it. But is I think is in is in McCorvey is not for another company. Oh. Mm -hmm. I'm... I have a very important question. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> I remember the, that McCormick sell pumpkin spice. Sell what? Is McCormick? Oh, okay, okay. We never only uh, only wash the, the 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 plastic the bottles and yeah. um, mm -hmm. you use oh again. Yes. Oh, okay. In the factory. Uh, the factory makes brooms, br brush, and dustpan. I think it's, it's, it's in English. Uh, for for and what do you use the bottles? Huh? For what you for, use for the what bottles? Products. For uh -huh. products. Yeah. All of the products because uh, the company makes. Uh, Fever, I think, fever. The fever for the brew. So this type of products doesn't doesn't have don't have expiration date. We can use in a long long time. So what happened to products that go out of season? I think. I think its products don't don't affect don't uh, don't don't become irrelevant because you use brooms and brush all the time when you clean your 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 home or you clean your your garden whatever so you can use um um too for too much time so mm -hmm. I think. <laughs> For me, this okay. The next okay. one is number two. Sara is asking Ramon some tips on the basics of inventory control. Read the conversation and take tunes practicing with a part. And if you want, you can start and then we change the the rules. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Sí, porque ya hicimos para una vez. <laughs> okay. How does inventory management work, Ramon? You need to have enough products in your inventory to sell to your customers when they want it. But you don't want to have too much in your inventory or you will be paying a lot of money to have it, to have it stored. Oh, well, I was thinking of invent, investing in some new cases for the iPhone X. Don't do it. Now that the iPhone X is on stores, you will not sell much. 
that's one of the problems with inventory management when you have too much inventory because you thought you could sell more than you than you did and there is a change when you get dirty the you get older and that it's a liar that the social socially makes you think that so no it is just a number the life before theories what? is very easy. The life before theories is easy. And late to theories is, is complicated. Your body is not is the same. Yeah, it could be. But and you have to enjoy every year that you're going to uh, win. And you can win a lot of weight, weight, peso, very easily. That, that is a, that, that all the things that you mentioned, that all depends on you, so. Sell to your customer. When you, they, when you, they want it. So it's important, um, because you don't have inventory, you don't sell. This is the, the short answer. Um, next question, number two, is this a good idea to have a uh, excess inventor? Awesome. A storage cost. Mm -hmm. the storage this, cost. this increased the storage cost. A storage mm -hmm. cost, 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 cost. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, also, I, I think a, uh, the excess is a uh, storage cost, and also uh, probably some uh, product uh, damage with damage with damage with the end the the expiration uh, mm -hmm. near to near to the 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 end expiration, and. I think it's not a good idea have an excess of inventory. Enough is okay, but excess is is bad idea. And excess and exceso y cuál es lo opuesto? Limit. Limit. O too low. No, cómo se diría? Too low. A few. A few. A few. A few. A few is also a bad idea because we don't have the the enough for provide a set in sales or or productions. Mm -hmm. The last one. What happen? What happens if you have too much inventory and market trends suddenly change? <laughs> mm, oops, mm, like, like, I, I, I know a, a case that with, with the spinnings, with the spinnings and the, 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 the octopus, the, the las caritas, mm -hmm. there was a boom, and then, ya no le importaron a nadie, la gente se quedó con... <laughs> Um, 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 um uh, can be no, uh, be more difficult to sell them. Yes, uh, I, I think this uh this question is is sometimes 
in, in, inevitable, how do you say inevitable? In, inevitable, no. Mm -hmm. It's a good idea to have a ex excess of inventory. No. No, that the album is on a store who you will not sell much. It is, it is, uh, is it a good idea to have an access to inventory? No, no. Mm -hmm. Your dog is bark. No, I don't have it. It's a good idea to have an excess of inventory in the... It's... Because in the market change. No, because it, it's the market change. You will you can put it. So throw um Lucas. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what happened if you have too much inventory in market trend? Suddenly change. Suddenly. Suddenly. Es el bus de ese. Esto. Está haciendo la barra, ¿eh? <laughs> ah, thank you. What happens if you have much inventory in my kitchen? Eh. Inventory management or no? Well, permitirme. Yeah. Mm. Okay, como que esta respuesta creo que era la de la de Paco. la de la última. Uh, ahí creo que sería no lo que dice donde dice no que that the el phone x is not a store you will not sell much por o sea porque por eso sería no tener muchos porque no voy a vender muchos o sea todavía no es conocido verdad that's one of the problem with the inventory management. When you have too much inventory because you throw, you could sell more than you did. That's because, because you don't know if the products. Not yet. What happen if you have too much inventory? Or if you cause the product? What happen if you have too much inventory and market trends on the way? You couldn't sell the product. And I, and I want to say, like, y el, y ese dinero, pues, no lo vas a poder recuperar, pero no sé. 
Yeah. You waste money. No sé vos. And when you lost this money. When you lost the money. You lost the money. Mm. Teacher tiene sueño. Why? ¿O quién, ¿O quién fue? No, no, bueno, teacher. Ah, ok. Why do you say that? I only listen a, a big, ¿cómo se dice? A bostezo. No, I didn't do that. My microphone was okay. off. Okay. <laughs> uh -huh. you, you don't want to tell who was trying to do that, right? <laughs> That's one of the problems with investment. I don't know. You couldn't see the pros and you lose the money. <laughs> Hmm. That happens if you have too much interaction that is change. Also you can also you don't have all the warehouse look serio. Also the warehouse is full. Okay. 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 Yeah. 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 Storage. Yeah. 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 Or you will be paying a lot of money to have in storage. No, no sería esa parte. Uh -huh. Pero. Uh -huh. ¿Dónde dice? En the first, en Ramón. The second part of, in the, the part of Ramón. Uh -huh. Es el tipo de persona que se cuestiona. So, eh, el punto es cuestionarte. ¿Por qué haces lo que haces? Si eres feliz haciéndolo o si estás acostumbrado a hacer. That is the point. Ah, tú eres bien existencialista. Yeah, exacto. As always. All the very, time. Very overthinker. It's an advantage and disadvantage too. Yes. I, I think sometimes you, you need do it and not think a lot of about things about everything Did yeah just... that definitely works in a lot of the things but the point is that even the things that you think that you're not thinking about it you have to Do you finish already? Yes, teacher. Okay. Or we think we are finished. Okay, very nice. Good. We're going to be back in a, in the main session in a few minutes. Okay. Okay, good. It's, it's like a... Not that much, but can be, mm -hmm. can be, um, um, how about that much? <laughs> Teacher, dijo que 
todos haremos en este ejercicio. Yeah, which one? Eh, in the four building vocabulary about inventory. Number four, number four, number four. Page, 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 um, uh, 34. 34. That was, yet, that was yesterday. No. Ah, no, 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 sorry, no, sorry. No, 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 yes. <laughs> it's for today, ya lo hicieron. En eso estamos. En eso estamos, pero no sé si lo dijo. No, esa no. Ahorita vamos a regresar ah, a bueno. la sesión principal. Ups. Ok, pero <risa> bueno, ya, llevan un, ya, ya, ya llevan un avance, ¿verdad? No, porque eh. no hemos terminado. <risa> ok, very nice, good. 50%. <risa> ok, good, awesome. Ok. Ahí está. Okay, very nice. You finished, right? Yes. Sir. Okay, very good. Awesome. Okay, right now I'm I'm gonna share the the screen. Okay, very good. Awesome. So you're going to tell me about the first question. Okay, let me ask you, for example, why is it important to have enough products in your inventory? Why is it important to have enough products in your inventory? Okay, can you tell me that? What is your answer? Uh, teacher, in my case, it's kind of difficult because we don't we don't handle a stock as an inventory. For example, if uh, I uh, if I sold a credit card today that credit card will be able maybe tomorrow or even to Monday. So um, that is not possible in my case. Obviously they have the plasticos as an inventory, but it's not a huge, it's not something relevant because they expect about a credit card. So in my case, that can be possible. Okay, um, in your case, mm -hmm. for example, that you need to um, provide um, the the credit card, but uh, you need the process in order to register right, in the system. Exactly, exactly. Or maybe an issue that we have uh, the last month is because uh, Mastercard didn't send to us um, one of the plasticos that we need. But not for the credit cards. It's because we have a we use a cashback from one of the credit cards. So that cashback it's uh, added to another plastico. So Mastercard didn't send to us those plasticos. So even that is not about our inventory because it's like their uh, inventory. Their inventory, like, and we only expect that. So, uh -huh. okay, very nice, good, awesome. Okay, what about the rest? According to this question, what do you have there in the conversation? Yeah, ah, Yvette, yes, you raise your hand. Yes, in my case, it's very important how, uh, to have no products uh, for, for the, the business sales goals. Okay, very nice. 
Okay, it's really important to have it, uh, to have products, enough products in the store, right? Right. Okay, very nice, good. Do someone have something different? The same. Okay, let's go with the next one. Is it a good idea to have an excess of inventory? Is it a good idea to have an access of inventory? What do you have there? Can you tell me as a volunteer? In my case, absolutely, teacher. Okay, very nice. Mm, I think no, it's, it, isn't good, it isn't a good idea because you will not if in the future you can sell these products. Okay, so in, according to what you say, Vanessa, and to what Belen says, two different opinions, right? But it's according to the business, right? Yeah, teacher, it's according because I think a company that sells food, it, it isn't a good idea. To yes. A lot of, a lot of type of, of food or whatever. Yeah, of course, yes, because... Um, Remember in the case of Belen, because there are like uh, cards, and so the cards are not going to be like damaged by the time you're going to have time in order to, to use it, right? But in products, uh, you need to be careful because they have a due time, right? In order to finish the usage of that product because it's not going to be healthy for people. So if that happens, so it means that it's a loss for you as the company, right? Uh, teacher, also okay. teacher. Yes. Uh, uh, so uh, this generate extra cost mm -hmm. with the storage. I'm, I'm sorry, I couldn't hear you. Very nice. The excess and um, excess excess of inventory can be uh, increase the. A storage cost. Oh, yes, of course. The access of inventory can increase the storage cost. Very good, awesome. That's right. Okay, very nice. Good. Someone else? Me, teacher. Okay, Carlos, yes. I think access of inventory is a bad idea. Mm -hmm. You, For example, in your warehouse, you need a storage more products and you have access you can storage and and your cost increase and you have you don't have enough money for your operations okay yes that's right okay so those those points that you are talking about um excess inventory is like something real so you need to be careful with it right because there are many aspects according to what you need uh, in the future or you're going to need in the future and it's not going to be able because you have an excess of inventory, right? Okay, very nice, good. Okay, let's go with our last question. What happens if you have too much inventory and market trends suddenly change? Mm-hmm. What happens if you have too much inventory and market trends suddenly change? Um, like I uh, said before, teacher, in my case, uh, we will work in la with the same program may for a long time ago. So it's kind of difficult to make a difference or maybe change something. So. In our case, if we have a lot of inventory, maybe the bank will put another, uh, uh, a promotion, for example, to that kind of uh, uh, credit cards in order to, or commission or for the customers in order to solve. So yeah, that could be in my case. Okay, very nice, good, that's, that's awesome, okay? Very nice, so uh, in the case, because you're different area of, uh, the, of your job, so that why it changes according to different products, right? Yes, okay. exactly. Okay, very nice. What about the rest? 
What do you have when that happens if you have too much inventory and make my market trends suddenly change? Mm -hmm. Yes. I think they have take a fast decision and sold very fast and maybe sold very cheap. Cheaper, right? Cheaper than the normal price. So uh, you will have to sell to sell the products cheaper than the normal price, right? Okay, that's good. Awesome. That's that's right. Okay. Um, what happened, for example, um, if you're not able to sell all the products? So it means you're going to have a loss, right? And you already paid for that product, so it's going to be that you're not going to have earnings that are going to be increasing your your budget because you didn't uh, make sure the way to buy the stuff and so you were full of aspects or things that are not going to be sell anymore right okay very good awesome right now the same people uh, el mismo equipo con el que estaban trabajando van uh, you're going to be working with this building vocabulary okay you're going to match the word related to inventory to their meaning. So you're going to look the, the number with the meaning here, right? So you want to put, for example, if you think this one is number one, you put number one here. Uh, if you think this is number four, for example, you're going to put number four and so on, right? You're going to be working with this. And of course, try to practice about the reading of this, this context. Then um, you're going to find, uh, to, to, um, to sorry, to choose, five items, okay, or five terms of these ones, and then you're going to create sentences for each one. So you're going to find, to choose five terms and to create a sentence talking about those terms, okay? In order how terms, to- Terms uh, in the meaning or whatever, whatever term. Term of these ones. For example, uh, if you want to talk about stocks, so try to make a sentence here talking about stocks. If you want to talk about, for example, inventory tracking, so you're going to write here about inventory tracking and so on. Okay. 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 Very nice. Take your time and practice as much as you can because it's a speaking practice too, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Let me check here. Vanessa, who do you work with? Baby. Hola. With Debbie. With Debbie, right? Yes. Okay, let me share. Okay. Belen, you work with uh okay, yes, teacher see. with Carlos. Okay, very nice. I'm gonna send you right now. Use for record of inventory levels, order, sales, and deliveries. Uh, a software system used to keep inventory in inventory tracking. No. Uh, let me see. Yo creería. Software system. Soft, uh -huh. Software system used to keep record of inventory levels, orders, sales, and delivery. Mm -hmm. Para mí inventory es inventory. Tracking. Inventory tracking. Number two. Number two. Replen, replenish. Okay. The next one is rep, rep, replenish. Esa, esa creo que es más que obvia porque hasta la palabra tiene. Replenish a store with fresh stocks or supplies. Creo, creería que es stock. Restock. O oh, no. 
restock. Restock. I think. Because it says replenish. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Replenish is reponer. Mm -hmm. Replenish. Restock. The refresh store, you see? Mm -hmm. The time oh. and place where a relay trans transactions is complete. In level and the point of sales. Point of sales are levels. Time and place. place where a scale transaction is completed. ¿Qué pasa? Are we going? First and first out. Stuck. Point of sale. Point of sale? So, I don't know. Which? I don't know. <laughs> Next La... one. <laughs> the next <laughs> items with expiration date like food or even cosmetic that can be become returned on or un 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 como se pronuncia esa palabra un un it's not so in time ahí sería Unusable. 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 Mm. ¿Qué es spoilage? ¿Qué significa eso? Deterioro, Pero... dice. Deterioro. Mm. For me, this Espera. items with expiration dates, like food, like dates, like food, or even cosmetics that can become rotten or unusable, if not sold in time. For me, it's number seven, could be first number in, first seven. out. First, uh, le leamos a demás para ver si no. Dice, the oldest inventory items are recorded as gold pierce. O sea, de los nueve viejos, <laughs> de los nueve viejos, al inventario. Recorded. Ese creo que sería uh, first in and no, no quiero ver. No sé, yo pienso. ¿Me gusta que sí? First in the oldest inventory, the oldest inventory. F mm. Mm. Spoil Spoilish Teacher, what is a spoilish? Teacher Teacher is there? gone <laughs> No, teacher is there <laughs> oh. Uh, maybe they he can listen us. Yes. Well, the point yes. is that point of sale pause for me is the software. Because yes. that is the only thing about, I agree. Yeah, okay. The second uh replaying replenish? replenish a store with fresh stock or supplies. Uh, um, number four. Restock. Exactly, restock. Okay. The time and place where a retail transaction is complete. Uh. Mm. Uh. I don't know. Continue maybe with the next one. You can read the next one. Maybe it's Polish. <laughs> I mean, that could be. Okay, the next. 
The next is inventory tracking. Inventory tracking, items with expiration dates. Okay. Next one, the oldest inventory items are recorded as all first. Ah, first in, in first out, right? Right. Okay. ¿Estás anotando? No. Ah. Okay, entonces espérate. But the first one is um la tres. POS. Okay. Y vamos a ir escribiendo el orden. Primero es tres, luego es or four, then no no. sabemos. Then two. Uh, two. Okay. Seven. Seven. Okay. Seven. Ah, sí, seven, es cierto. Merchandise keep in a warehouse and available for sale or distribution. A stock? Yes, let's talk. Number one. Okay. Hi. And can you read the last one? The amount that should be able available at any time for an item when an item falls below par, it is replenished. So we only have restock. No, the spoilage and par levels. What is par levels? Par levels. Six. Huh? Yes, number six. And what is that? The amount that should be able to at any time for any item. What? The last is par levels. I guess. You guess. I don't know. And you guess. Yes. <laughs> okay. Six. Uh, levels. Va, entonces quiere decir que la cinco sería the time and place where a retail transaction is complete. Spoilers. Vamos a buscar. No, yo creo que estamos mal. Ok. As Google says that is polish is like deterioro de alimentos. Hey, teacher. Do you finish already? Actually, we finished the assignment, uh, the first, I don't know, first group meeting. You finished the part of when you have to match the words with the- uh, With the meaning. correct answer or correct definition, yes. But Walter, have the answers and I think he's away right now. Okay, very nice. E, uh, the, the next part, uh, then you have to choose five and to create questions. I'm working with on that because I don't know if Adela is connected to because oh. both stay away. Okay, very nice. Let me know later, okay? Okay.
In the your brows, no. I don't know. I I feel that something is wrong. This teacher, we are on fire. Do you finish? No. Almost. I, I love okay. Okay, did, you nice. say, did you say the fire activity too? Or only yes, four and five. Four and five. Uh, yes, four and five. Teacher, help us, please, with the four with the four uh, sentence. Siento que le falta algo ahí para Let me share. I want to make some. Let me check. Let me check. Let me check. Let me check. Number four. Mm -hmm. The inventory truck can help us to know the real time delivery products. Mm, by the end, I don't know if you want to add something else. Oh, okay. 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 Mm -hmm. okay. okay. The last yeah. one. Hagamos una con la siete. First, before. Mm, okay. Okay. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. I, it's, it's mandatory to mm -hmm. use first in and first out in the delivery. Mm -hmm. Mandatory. ¿Qué dije? <laughs> it's mandatory first in. Oh, no sé si Rosa use, lo vas a poner first. Use to first. Un solo. <laughs> First, first, we first, 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 Mm -hmm. It's mandatory to use uh, to. I know. Como dije, es obligatorio usar el FIFO en los despachos. Eh, en los despachos. No. Cuando se despache el producto. Yeah. Mm -hmm. When the when the mm -hmm. when the delivery. Pro deliver when when the products are are delivered uh -huh. yes. in pasado or in, or, or, solo, or delivery no delivery it's okay delivery when the products sean teacher is called this is, is this correct? Yeah, for the teacher. Which one? The, <laughs> number five. It's mandatory to you. Okay, ahí cuando estamos utilizando el it, tenemos que utilizarlo ya contractado, ¿verdad? Y es que no, no le pude ponerla. Ajá, porque así, si ahí lo, ok. Ah, si lo utiliza así, sería posible. Ajá, ahí sí ya. It's mandatory to mm -hmm. use first in, first out, FIFO, when the products are delivered. Okay, muy bien. Oh, delivered, delivered. No, verdad. Tiene when que the ser products are delivered. Uh, uh, first of all, uh, when the products are delivered. Yes, with in past, delivered. Oh. Mm -hmm. Ya le voy a ir teniendo el pasado. Mm -hmm. Delivered. Mm -hmm. Delivered. Like this? Yes, very nice. Oh, we finished. Very nice, nice, awesome. But, but let, let me take the, 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 the screen. Okay. The screenshot yeah. for me. We are subir un poquito. Oops, mm -hmm. too much. If out of a stock. If the product is out of the stock. Mm -hmm. 
we have to restock it. To restock it. Well, we must to we must restock to stock it. Let's check it. Stock it. A ver, a ver. Mm. Oh, well, but if the product is is a uh, no, no, uh, out of stock, we must stop immediately. Immediately. Yeah. Right now. <laughs> the next mm -hmm. word. Pero ahí ya usamos dos más, stock y restock. Mm -hmm. <laughs> ya nos cuenta como dos. Ah. <laughs> yeah. Dos padres. Dice. Number three. Mm. Spoilers. Is spoilage. So yeah, items with expiration date, like food or even cosmetic, that can become returned or use usable, creo, if not sold in time. Ahí como referencia, nos da una referencia a la comida, ¿verdad? If the spoilage sería the spoilage the spoilage and spoil we can sell us to we can if the spoilage no, of the product affects or or customer We couldn't sell the new product as the as a consequence. It I don't know is it is Polish. I suppose that's it. Yeah, that's it. Okay, do you finish? No, teacher. No, I don't even finish. understand no, why yes, my screen teacher. turns like black. You, you, you didn't what? I didn't understand why my screen turns in black. Oh, and, and really? So you couldn't yeah. work that way? No, because it, first I was in the class and in the group, and then my 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 screen turns black, and then I was in here, so was ah. so fast that I didn't recognize that the, 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 the groups are over. Oh, okay. Very nice. 
Okay, very nice. We're going to work right now on, the, on it, okay? Okay, so we have these. Let me see if you can watch the screen. Yeah, can you watch the screen? Yes, yeah. Can. Okay, yes. very nice. So we're going to work. We have the first concept right now, and the number one stock. Okay, so and here we have the the ones that we're going to choose, right? But we're going to read the concepts. For example, like these ones. Oh my God. I'm sorry, my mouse is crazy. Okay. We're going to read this concept and then we're going to decide which one is the correct according to this one, okay? okay. Let, me let me listen to uh, volunteer. Who wants to read it? Me, did. Okay, thank you. Very nice, David. A software system used to keep record of inventory levels Order sales and deliveries. Deliveries, very nice, good. Deliveries. Delivery, ah. yes. It's a plural. Es, es, Se recuerdan que utilizamos también para los verbos cuando terminan con J y una consonante antes, aquí también con mm -hmm. los nombres, así funciona. Ok. Debbie, con su equipo, ¿cuál, cuál fue el nombre que le pusieron a este concept? Inventory tracking. Number two. Yes. Inventory tracking. Okay, very nice. Good. What about the rest? Do you have the same or different? Different teacher. Okay. Belen, which one do you have? Point of sale. Post. Point of sale. Post. Okay, very nice. Good. What about the rest? The same. The same of who? Uh, the last, say. Ah, the same of Belen, point of sales. Yes. yes. Okay, very nice, good. What about the rest? Hello, students. We put a number two inventory tracking. Okay, very nice, good. Okay, so it's number two, inventory tracking. Why is number two? Because we're talking about a software system used to keep record, so, and tracking is the same, right? Record and tracking, inventory levels, order sales, and deliveries. So when we talk about inventory tracking, ¿verdad? Es un record, ¿verdad? Okay, guardar ahí todo lo del sistema del inventorio, right? The inventory, the inventory. Okay, invent okay. So uh, you're going to um, save all the records about levers, order sales and deliveries. So you record everything. Okay, very nice, good. Let's go with a second one. Okay, who wants to really volunteer? It's the number four. Number four, okay, but the concept, it's can you please read it? Re replenish? Mm -hmm. A store with fresh store or supplies is restocked. Okay, replenish store with fresh stock or supplies. Okay, which one? Do you have number? Which one do you say? Number four. Restock. Restock. Okay, very nice. Good. What about the rest? Restock too. Restart two, okay. The rest? Four. Number four. Restart. Okay, this was his number four. Really nice, good, awesome. So we have number two and number four ready, right? Okay, very nice. Good. What about the next one? Who wants to really volunteer? Me, teacher. Okay, thank you. The time and place where retail transaction is completed. Number the time and two. place when retail transaction is completed. Okay, which one do you have there? Number three. Number three. Okay, what about the rest? Number three. Okay, the rest, do you have the same or, or is someone with a different uh, concept? Yeah, in um, our case, we put number two, but was wrong because the number two is the first one. So, <laughs> so, 
Here is number three, right? Yeah. <laughs> okay, very nice. Good. I'm going to see what's the address. Yes. Okay, very nice. What about the rest one? Me, teacher. Okay, thank you. Items with expiration dates like food or even cosmetics that can be that can become rotten or use you oh my god I don't know unusable how to, unusable unusable if not sold in time okay very nice which one do you have there we put uh number five okay Polish. which one is okay. okay. Spoil, spoilage, verdad? Very nice, Spoilage. spoilage. Number five, do someone have something different? The same. No. The same. Okay. The same. The same, very good, awesome. Okay, let's go with the next one. Mm -hmm. Volunteer to read it. The oldest inventory items are recorded as sold first. Okay, the oldest inventory items are recorded and sold first. Very nice, very nice, good. So which one is? Mm, I write first in, first out. First in, first out. Okay, very nice, good. So it's number seven. Do you have the same one or different one? Yes, teacher. The same yes, teacher. The same. The same. Okay, very good. Good that student. That is the only term that I already know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but so it means it's new vocabulary for you, right? Yeah, at, at least the first in and first out, I, I learned because of my mom, because she works at Pizza Hut. So I, I, I grew up with all of the kind of vocabulary because of her. Okay, very nice, good, awesome. Okay, what about the next one? Merchandise, who wants to read it? Hey, teacher. Okay, thank you. Merchandise keep in a warehouse and available for sale or distribution. Okay, very nice, kept, kept. Okay, kept. Okay, very nice, good. Okay, merchandise kept in a warehouse and available for sale distribu or distribution. So which number do you have? Number one. Number one, okay. I think number one, yes. Okay, everybody has number one. Okay, very good. Awesome. And the last one, of course, is already done, right? But can you please read it, a volunteer to read it? Me, teacher, if you want. Okay, thank you. The amount that should be available at any time for an item. When item? Uh -huh. an item falls below part in the replacement. Part, it is replenished. Replenish. Replenished. Replenished. Sound, right? Lleva al final un sonido como este. Replenished. Replenished. Okay, porque la primera acá está en presente. Replenished. 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 Okay, yes. Very nice. Good. Okay. Which one are some sentences that you created? ¿Algunas de las oraciones que crearon? I remember that one of them uh, was if we didn't use a pause, we wouldn't be able to receive and payment cards. Okay, if we don't use. If we don't use a pause, mm -hmm. we, we wouldn't be able to receive a payment cards. Wouldn't? Be able. Wouldn't? Wouldn't be? Mm -hmm. Ah. Mm -hmm. Wouldn't uh, are you sure wouldn't? Uh well, <laughs> no. 
uh -huh. remember not... remember the model this the the this, the first conditional we already explained yeah, it amor. Yeah. Pero, yeah. will not oh, yeah. no it's not will not yes will not or will want not? verdad ah, okay will not able to receive payment cards we won't be able why won't ah won't the, the, ah but it's the same will not or won't yes right? yes ah, okay 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 awesome very good good another one alguien más de las oraciones que tienen la number two o lo que sea students the company claro has many points of sale the the company claro has many points of sales yeah okay very nice good what about the rest me teacher okay the warehouse has enough stock for this month the warehouse has enough stock for this month very good awesome somebody else yeah. I have, we need to have stock for the raw material for the production. We need to have stock for the raw material for the production. Very good, awesome. The what else? Inven the inventory tracking allows us to know the real time delivered products. The inventory tracking has not the real time for? The delivered products. Delivered products, okay, very nice, good, awesome. Okay. Very good students. Vamos a pasar hasta otra parte porque we need to work with these ones. And we're going to talk about this. Okay. Uh, can you, Walter, please help me to read this uh, adjective? Yes. Okay. Um, are we able to design a basic plan to organize inventory management system? We'll, okay, I will be able to design a basic plan to organize an inventory management system. Okay, very nice, good. Here we have some questions, right? Can you please read number one? Uh, let me listen to Mariano. Are you able to read right now? Yes. Okay, can you please read this first question? Let's start. How okay. do I calculate the right um, amount of the inventory to a stock. Okay, very nice, good. Here's the first question. How do we calculate the right amount of inventory to stock? Good. Can you please read the second question? How do I determine the right price for my inventory? How do I determine the right price for my inventory? Okay, very nice, good. And here we have a conversation, okay? Uh, I will need just two volunteers, okay? Well, I'm gonna look the volunteers. Okay, I'm gonna look for Jorge is going to be, let me listen to, let me show here. Okay, uh, my loud voice. Okay, Carlos, you're going to be Jorge, okay? Okay. Okay, very nice. And Aminda, how are you? Good evening, welcome. Hello, teacher. How are you? Very nice, here in the class. Okay. <laughs> okay, very nice. Are you going to be Susan? Okay, perfect. Okay, thank you, very nice. Okay. I am having a lot of time with my business. Susan, I need some advice about the inventory management. Okay, I see you keep notes on any scrap on paper, of paper. Jorge, the first step to implement, to implement an organized inventory management system is getting all of your product and vendor information in one place. I recommend, I recommend you do this in a spreadsheet and record notes their consist, consistently. I don't know. <laughs> Consist consistently. Uh, consistently, consistently. Okay. okay. Very nice. Sure, I can do that. I didn't really give much attention to my notes. 
now now you know and i look here the labels are falling off the packets by labeling inventory properly you ensure that your product gets stored at current needs in the right spot so that your employees can find them easily when when needed when needed okay very nice good awesome very nice good Vamos a ocupar a alguien más. Vamos a ver si me ayuda. Vanessa is going to be uh, Susan. And Marianne is going to be George. Okay. Okay, teacher. Okay. I'm having a bad time with the business, Susan. I need some advice about the inventory management. Okay. I see you keep notes on any graph or any scrap of paper yours. The first step to implement an organized inventory management system is getting all of your product and vendor information in one place. I recommend you do this in a spreadsheet and record notes there consistently. Sure, I can do that. I didn't really give much attention to my notes. Now you know. And look here, the labels are falling off the package. By labeling inventory properly, you ensure that your products get stored accurately in the right spot so that your employees can find them easily when needed. Okay, very nice, good. Vamos a ver acá, scrap. Okay, scrap of paper, repeat, scrap of paper. Scrap of paper. Scrap of paper. Scrap of paper. Okay, cuando decimos en scrap of paper, como decir cualquier pedazo de papel, yeah. cualquier cosa, ¿verdad? lo escribís, right? Scrap of paper. Scrap of paper. Okay, then we have a spreadsheet. 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 Okay, Teacher, I'm... yes. What is the meaning of a spreadsheet? Ah, a eso iba. <laughs> Very ah, good. Okay. Two okay. Uh, hoja de cálculo. Es una hoja de cálculo, ¿verdad? Cuando estamos hablando, bueno, yo de, de números y temas financieros, ahí sí, ¿verdad? Pero yo sé que necesitan una hoja de cálculo. Todo lo que hacen ahí, pues, me cuesta entenderlo bien, ¿verdad? But a spreadsheet is an hoja de cálculo, right? Okay. Like Excel. Yes. Excel. Yes, mm -hmm. I like Excel. Okay, people who handle Excel is really, really nice, right? Because they use formulas and all the, the stuff and they are good working on it. Okay, then we have consistently. Repeat consistently. 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 Okay, very nice, good. Mm -hmm. Okay, properly. 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 Okay, aquí tenemos una palabra que normalmente llega hasta accurate, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Pero le hemos puesto el li y aquí significa, perdón, pues se pronuncia accurately. 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 Okay, easily. 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 Okay, Easily. very nice. Good. La última actividad que vamos a tener ahorita antes de que nos vayamos a, a la última, a la parte final de la clase, ¿verdad? Lo voy a poner ahorita para que practiquen esta conversation y la pronunciation de some words that you need there, right? Okay. Eh, y pueden también, uh, van a discutir eh, estas preguntas, así como hicimos en la primera actividad, ¿verdad? Y luego nos vamos a la conversation. Y contestamos estas tres preguntas. ¿Ok? I'm going to push you here right now in groups. Ok. I think right now everybody is available, right? Okay, if you have any problem at the moment of speaking, just let me know, okay? Okay, teacher. Okay, Roberto, you are, you are able, right?
Roberto. Ok, no, it's here. Yes, teacher. Ah, yes. Ok, very nice. Good, 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 good. And let me look another one. Rose, are you able to speak? Yes, teacher. Ok, awesome. Very nice. Good. Um, I just hear very scary awesome. Okay, there we go. Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay. You have practice. to there. <laughs> practice. Practice the, 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 the conversation. Yeah. Okay. Um, if you want, I can start and then we change. Okay. I'm, I'm having... hot. I'm... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Okay, I'll start you and then. Okay. I'm having a bad time with my business, Susan. I need some advice about inventory management. Okay, I see. You keep notes on any scrap of paper, George. The first step to implement. Okay, who was it here? Are you working? Hello, teacher. Okay, are you working with the conversation? No, oh, let me see because I have a problem and don't listen the instruction. Is the the conversation that page? 35 mm -hmm. and this called the answer only. Uh, it's 35, yes, the conversation and the answer. Okay. Yeah, thank you, teacher. At the moment, I'm Okay, very nice. Pini. Okay, I okay. see you keep I see you keep notes on any scrap of paper yours. The first step to implement an organizing inventory management system in getting all of your products and vendor information in one place. I recommend you do this on a spreadsheet in a record note there consistently. Okay. Okay, this is the, the, the first problem uh, for George is he don't have a, a organized inventory management systems or, or inventory management systems because okay. he don't have uh, all information about the products, I think. Are you agree or not? What do you yeah, think? Yeah, I'm agree. Okay. This is the first is the first practice. Uh, he don't. So we have to respond to the questions. What Hola. are the? I have to respond to the questions. Then the questions are mine. Yes, the questions, but as commented. 
Oh, I calculate the right amount of the inventory. What system. are some of George's bad practice in inventory management? What are some of George's bad practice in the inventory management? And George, I'm having bad time with my business. Also. I need some advice about inventory management. Give much attention to me. No pone mucha. Dice... I didn't really give much attention to my notes. Yes. De lo poco que habló Jorge. <laughs> <laughs> Un tipo de pocas palabras. <laughs> eh, okay, I see you keep notes and, and a scrub of paper, George. The first step to implement and organize inventory management system is getting all of your product and vendor information. Okay. What are the same? Sería, he didn't really give. Uh, he needed to create a spreadsheet and record the notes. And record notes constant, consistent. Consistent. What are the uh, Oh, no. This is for the second question. What are Susan's recommendations to solve this issue? What are Susan's recommendations to solve Susan to solve some of the uses? I use. ¿Qué? ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Issues. 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 Sí. Voy a decir price. Price. And um, we check the cost of production and add to the, the margin. No, no sé cómo decir margen. Profit. Okay. And that's the way that we determine the right price for right price for the inventory. In your case, what do you determine that in your company? Is similar to the before question, and you and in the warehouse we have a uh, our rack materials, packaging materials, uh, all things. When then we use to make a final product, and also we have uh, uh, the final products in the in the warehouse. So all these subjects products, materials, uh, uh, average price, average cost, average price. It is um, for the materials, uh, what was say uh, before, is the average prices in the time. But the final products depends on the, um, Depends on the prices, material, cost operation, and another cost um, when when affecting the manufacturing process. So the this person in my in my case, this person, the country inventory. Uh, um, management these these numbers and then we share with uh, all the team okay it's complicated but your work is really important for the company right because you check all the things in my case, uh, I don't see, uh, I don't see. Mm, the bad label of the products. And. Bad the, labeling, yes. Yes, and, and the product is not in correct place. 
it's not a storage stored in correct place. Yes. Yeah, oh. because she said um, that your employees can find them easily when needed because it's not in in, in correct place. Okay. Okay, for the second. What are Susan's? What are recommendations to solve some of the issues? Mm -hmm. Susan said the first step to implement an organized inventory management system. Mm -hmm. And second, recommend you do this in a spirit sheet. Mm -hmm. Express it, teacher. Yes. What What's the meaning? Spread sheet. Spread sheet. Hoja de cálculo. Uh, okay. Thank you. Welcome. Yes. She recommended that. Uh, uh, spreadsheet. Okay, for the last one, what is more you could <laughs> give for it to get his inventory of is is a uh, uh, solo music. I think Jorge need do a, a physical inventory. I think. I'm sorry. I can hear. We finished it. Okay, very nice. Do you answer the questions? Yep. Okay, very nice. Good. We're going to the main session right now. Thank you. Okay. Presentation. Okay, do you finish? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Presentation is <laughs> ya, ya está ya está ready, Rosibel, solo para esperar yeah. su nombre. <laughs> sí. <laughs> okay, very nice. Ya solo les quedan tres clases prácticamente, ya, ¿verdad? Solo tres clases. And then free. Okay, uh, I'm going to call your name as soon as you listen your name, please tell me present, okay? Adela Trinidad González Consuera. Present. Ok. Aminda René Figueroa de Manzano. Present. Very nice. Belén Batre García. Present, teacher. Very good. Carlos William Membreño Núñez. Carlos Membreño. Debbie Yasmín Girón Ramírez. Present. Okay, very nice. Domingo Alexander González. 
Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. José Present. Roberto. Present. Ok. José Roberto Martínez Bernabé. Leticia Guadalupe García de Miranda. Mariano José Paca Santa María. Present teacher. Okay, very nice. Oscar Anulfo Villatoro Herrera. Present. Okay, Rosemary Ventura de Arguello. Present teacher. Very nice. Rosibel del Carmen López. Present teacher. Very nice. Good night. Salva Salvador, good night. Salvador Augusto Sorto Rivas. Present, mister. Okay. Sonia Ivette Alvarenga. Present. Okay. Vanessa Noemí Reyes Lemus. Present, teacher. Okay. Walter Marcas Tanina Perlera. Present. Okay. Very nice. Good. Okay, students. Uh, see you tomorrow. Okay. At the same hour, on the same channel, on the same place. Okay. Okay, okay good bye night. Bye. bye bye. Sweet dreams. Bye, bye. bye teacher. Bye bye. Teacher. Okay. I, yes. Teacher, I can't hear my name. Yeah, For I call you two times. Twice. Yes, my my internet is going down. <laughs> okay, let me share right now. Yes, I put you present because I, I came here to check if you were connected. Okay, thank you. Okay, bye bye, Mister. Good night. Mr. Good night. Bye. Hey, Leti, how are you? Uh, can you take me, please? I'm, I'm sorry, I, I can't hear you very well. Leti? I'm fine. Could you, could you listen your name when I call you to the attendance? Letty? Okay. See you tomorrow, Letty, at the same hour. Uh, you got connected with a different Okay. Can you listen to me? Letty? Letty, Letty?